The legislator is about 45 minutes away from adjournment for the year. It overturned the state's 158 year old citizens arrest law. It passed a year round daylight savings time bill, though Congress would have to approve it. And it spent a lot of time on granny cams. Doug Richards is live at the Capitol with more tonight. I show we did a little math, uh, which is always dangerous a few minutes ago, and we calculated that uh, the House and the Senate were passing bills at a rate of about, or at least taking votes at a rate of about one every seven minutes uh, going into this final day of the session. So they're working at a furious pace, and it took, uh, it, we took notice when they spent more than an hour in the Senate talking about a bill to regulate granny cams. Uh, that's hidden cameras in nursing homes and other facilities, some of which have captured images of wrongdoing and held wrongdoers accountable. The House passed a bill to require long-term facilities to allow granny cams, but to disclose their existence. Advocates for the elderly howled that the measure tips off abusers as to which rooms are under surveillance, and uh, senators seem to agree. Resident A has the big sign up, says, oh, better not come in here. We got video monitoring. So then you know anybody who doesn't have that up, they are fair game. The Senate changed the bill to allow both hidden cameras as well as cameras mounted in plain sight. There was talk that this would uh, gut the bill. Uh, and it may get some time in the House before the legislature adjourns. About an hour from now, uh, we talked with a rather influential lobbyist just a few minutes ago who said he was convinced that it would all come together before midnight. Um, but there are a lot of very hopeful lobbyists here in the halls of the Capitol as the minutes tick by toward adjournment. Back to you, Ayesha.